Hi everyone! How are we doing? Oh my gosh, it has been a hot minute. A very solid minute since we have, I'm like, my heart's beating so fast. Since we've done a live stream together, it is, it's been since the 28th of January, I think. It has been a long time, and I have missed this so much. Uh, before we hop in, I want to say thank you to everybody who was patient with me um, uh, for Saturday, for Saturday, for Sunday, because Sunday was just a hard day, and I really wanted to come on and do this because, you guys, I'm going to show you really quick. I had my banners, like I had this ready to go, and then I had this, and this, and this. They're all ready to go. And uh, just, it just wasn't happening. And I had changed my, I had changed my, hang on, I'm trying to, what, there's like a new button that I don't understand what it is. I tried to change, and I changed my color scheme. So like my pink right here, over there, it was red, so it was really cute. Uh, first, I guess I should probably let Instagram know we are live. Um, so thank you for being patient with me, and I'm glad we get to talk tonight, and you joined me tonight. Thank you so much. Uh, let me know how the connection is. I'm on my hotspot, so it should be fine. Should be should be good. My hotspot doesn't usually fail me. So uh, come join us on the YouTubes. I've missed this. Oh, oh, dang, I saved it on accident. Oops. I've missed this. I've missed chatting. You know, I have. I'll be honest. I I got some wine with me tonight. I got some some Riesling. You can't really see it because of the glare. It's fine. It needs to warm up a little bit because it is a little bit too cold for me. All right. So I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start here. I think. Well, I mean, yeah. Where are the comments? There we go. Hello, hello, hello. Also, I'm trying out this new. Uh, bubble. I keep always oh, with the wrong side. Trying out this new little bubble thing. I don't know. I think it's cute. It's kind of different. Uh, I like it for now, anyway. Uh, this is my first live stream. Oh my gosh, well, I'm so glad you're here. Yay! We're gonna get a lot done tonight because you guys, I am. Tell me, <laughs> I'm, I'm so out of practice. Tell me what you guys are working on, where you're at in your work in progress. I am on like the angsty part towards the end. Oh. I'm living for it. And then if I finish it tonight, beta readers will get their, their stuff tonight. So yes, I'm going to finish it tonight. I'm not going to bed till it's done. Mickey. Hey, Eva. Hello. Um, Petra. Hello. I seriously miss this so much as well. It has been too, too long, too long. Oh my goodness. And I am not doing as many live streams this month either. So that was just, oh, I should have done more to be honest, but um, why my lighting keeps changing, even though I am my lighting is not changing. Like the camera is just adjusting and then readjusting, and then I hate it. <laughs> hello, hello, you guys! I'm so glad you're all here. Drea, yay! Jesse, hello, yay! We're all here tonight. We're gonna get some words in. Oh my gosh, Alexis, hello, and Alexis, hello. Love that. Um, painting my nails, and the, you know what the thing is I don't like about this the bubble uh because it takes a minute to load. Y'all notice that? I don't know if I like it. Uh, <laughs> painting my nails, and I'll switch to more developmental edits. Nice. I need to paint mine. My white had has had on. And I painted finger normal white nail polish, and it just uh, uh, it does it did not stay. It's fine. <laughs> Making brownies. I am so jealous. We made cookies last night, and I think I might make some more, like pop some more in the oven because we like keep some and like put them in the fridge for like the next few days. You know, it's amazing. Uh, I'm not laying my new face work in progress. I've had in the works. Very exciting. New stuff's always so fun. Hey, just popping, stopping by to say hi before dinner. I'll be back in a little bit. Happy writing. Well, thank you for popping in and saying hello. Can't wait to see you come back. Uh, we're probably going to go until 9, my friends. 9 o'clock. Two hours. Not working my own project tonight. Instead, I'm beta reading for a friend. I'm chapter 3 of 5 for the night. Oh, very nice. Very nice. I have to beta read. If I have time tonight, I will definitely do that because I need to, <laughs> I need to edit my YouTube video. <laughs> I'll be working on editing my manuscript tonight. We'll try to edit a YouTube video before I have to work. <clears throat> 
Well, very nice. Lots of productivity going on there. Uh, started doing a Wizard of Oz retelling. Ooh, love that. That's exciting. Mickey had two days off on accident, so I'm hoping to hobby back into the draft too, a book two to catch up. Very nice. That's so exciting. Had two days off on accident. Two days off sounds amazing. Although it, 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 I mean, it. I'm I'm happy you had two days off. I just said that, and I realized I frequently have two days off in a row. So two days off is is very very nice. <laughs> Forgot how much I rambled. <laughs> I'm currently taking a 7K word outline into first draft, only on chapter two. Taylor, that's exciting. Oh my gosh. Uh, love that outline. I am such a terrible outliner, I swear. Do you have like a hair on my mouth? No, thanks. <laughs> but I'm glad it works for you. Yay. Speaking of new projects, uh, like first drafts and stuff, I'm going to be starting Edith's first draft uh next week hopefully maybe this weekend i have to beta read today like tomorrow and stuff um but i'm starting edith's first draft soon and guys i'm so excited i already have a title for it like oh <laughs> i love working on new stuff just been dry the first three chapters of our friends four only had 15 minutes to myself this past week so it's so good for so far well i'm so excited you're liking it so far jana thank you so much oh my gosh i cannot wait to hear what your thoughts are as it continues are you in chapter 15 of book three of my dystopian fantasy series I'm almost done with chapter 15. <gasps> that's exciting amanda yay look at you that's awesome and yaza is here hello I wrote 50k words already, but forgot what happened exactly because so I wanted to pre-editing now. <laughs> Love that. <laughs> I'm the same way. I I started draft I started editing today this today. Last night I went to bed at 3 30. And I woke up today and I started to get into it. And I'm like, I got this far. Wow. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I s I've been staying up so late these past few days, and you guys, I'm here for it. <laughs> I've missed it. Just working on homework tonight. Well, that is very productive. I like it. Working on Wattpad story tonight. Hoping to have the first chapter done by Saturday. Ooh, you've got this. You've got this. Along with that, I'm going to make some banana bread between sprints. <gasps> I still need to make banana bread. I haven't. Everybody else did it for, like, during quarantine, and I haven't yet. And I need to jump on that bandwagon. I'm, like, very late. But I want to do it. I love banana bread. Just made cookies. We are twins. Twins. I'm um, actually working on a screenplay today. Very exciting. Drea, I finally finished posting my nano project to Wattpad. I'm continuing the love interest point of view tonight. <gasps> yes. Yay. So exciting, Drea. Are you having fun with that? Because I know we talked about how fun it is to write in a love interest point of view. And I swear, I love it. <laughs> Although Vincent's was really hard for me to write. I wrote his point of view for the Patreon. And y'all, I had a terrible time with Vincent's point of view. I don't know why. I just could not get into his headspace. It's very weird. Um, but we're not even 10 minutes in, and I think I'm ready for the first sprint. Are you guys? And then some waiting on comments to roll in, which I don't know if I am or not. Either way, I think we should start with our first sprint. Um, I think I'm going to save cracking open the wine until uh, the second sprint. But let me know, is anybody else going to be drinking with me or is everyone else going to be pr like productive and not drink alcohol? I know, I know once I start drinking that, I might go downhill. <laughs> so, but I saved it. I saved it y'all for the stream for Valentine's Day and, and it, it just, it did not happen. So, all right. So a 15 minute sprint. I, I did it. Let's do that. Let's do that. Also, my background's different. I need to change it. Before, I'll show you guys what it was. Because for the freaking Valentine's Day one, I changed it from what it was. And I changed it to this. And you can't see that. But I can you use your imagination? It's my picture. <laughs> and it says writing sprints. And it says February 14th. It's, it, was, it was cute. And now I, I had already deleted my other one. So I got to figure out a new background. I'm a hot mess tonight. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you would think I had I opened my bottle of wine already, and I definitely have not. <laughs> All right, 15 minutes. Let's do 15:34. I can I can get down with 15:34. Uh, All right, friends. 
you can tell this is like the first time I've talked to anybody like really all day. <laughs> um, okay, 15 minutes, 34 seconds on this clock. All right, let, oh, I, oh crap, I clicked off. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, let's do this.
Okay, first sprint is done. How did we do? Uh, I kind of struggled. Hang on, let me see how many words I wrote. Well, I didn't really write, I'm editing. Uh, I'm almost done with that scene. It's, it's the emotion behind it, not sold on it just yet. <laughs> uh, maybe I will get there. Um, I don't know. I'm not really, not really digging. I, I'm digging it like it's fun and it's angsty and, you know. But a part of me is wondering if it's too angsty. Uh, I'm trying to put myself in Stella's shoes and I just... I mean, if I were her, um, I can't really say much. I'm sorry. Uh, but I feel like I, I... We'll keep going. I mean, honestly, obviously we'll keep going because it needs to get done. But <laughs> I'm not really... I don't know. I think it's because I'm coming down the home stretch and I'm like, is this good enough? Like, I'm going to have to send it to this. I'm going to have to send this to people. Like, people are going to read this. You know, uh, I used to... I, I had... I keep stuttering. I remember I told somebody that the idea of sending things to betas didn't really freak me out as much as arc readers, but that was a lie. Things... But sending to betas is still scary <laughs> because it's so rough and I'm just... I'm just self-conscious of it. <laughs> Jackie, hey! Uh, there we go. 21,218. Uh, total? Because that's an awesome total word count. Hey. Yes, to words. Uh, word, wait, words for the sprint or words total? I'm, I'm, I'm thinking total. But that's a great number. Wow. Finishing editing a YouTube video. Very nice. Mandy, I need to edit mine. It's fine. We'll get there. Probably. I subbed coffee to make, so it's good. 288 words and finish a chapter. Very nice, Jesse. That's awesome. Uh, 222 words in that editing sprint. Very good, Kaylee. Yay, yay. And Alexis outlined one chapter, one scene left in another. Ooh, you're so close to finishing that chapter. That's crazy. 115 words in a very nostalgic scene. Nice. Ooh, I love nostalgia. That's awesome. I don't know why, but that sprint was super productive for me. Well, yay! I'm so happy it was productive for you, Tabitha. That's Those are the best. Those are the best. Uh, hello, hello! So glad you can make it! I wrote 300 words, but I don't really like this chapter. <laughs> and I had to check responses to my personal essay for school. Well, I feel like moving along is probably a good thing, even though you're not really sold in the chapter just yet, because moving along might may, may give you an idea on how to fix it, like, when you're down the road, you know? So that's awesome. That's awesome that you're productive. 675 words at Sprint. <gasps> I got on a roll and wrote a ton of dialogue. Okay, dialogue is the best. Holy cow. I love dialogue. What do you guys like? Do you like dialogue or do you not like dialogue? Because I, I know it can kind of bo go both ways. I personally love dialogue. <laughs> I love it very much. <laughs> yes, everyone, make sure to stay hydrated. Be better than me because I don't, I need to drink more water, y'all. I don't like water. I, I, I've been trying to get better at it. I, I'm making a conscious effort. But it's not really. Um, I want to say something fun. I, I can't show you, but I still want to talk about it. I mean, which is kind of rude, isn't it? I got my cover for uh, Destel's book today. And I am just super excited about it. So we're gunning for, well, I don't want to say we're, I'm just one person. I'm gunning for May 28th. Is that the date that I'm gunning for? I think it's May 28th. Is it a Tuesday? No, 25th. May 20, no, May 18th? Crap, hang on. Oh no, May 25th because the first is Memorial, wait, when is Memorial Day? It's not telling me on my calendar on my computer. One second. I want to tell you guys because I want to give you something because I know I haven't been really talking about Destella's book too much. I'm kind of holding off. Okay, Memorial Day is the 31st. So, yes, the 25th is when I am aiming for Destella's book to be released to the world. I have the cover. I have the title in my brain. Like, fun things are coming. I'll probably release the title in March. And then the cover in April. I'm doing a shorter pre-order this time just to see if that helps, like, rank or anything. Just trying something out. So I'm going to be doing a one-month pre-order instead of, like, two and a half, which is what I normally do. Um, so when it hits the 
two month mark is probably when I'll start talking about it a bit more because that's probably when I'll release the title. And I wanted to tell you guys because I don't ever talk about Destella's book. I, I know I'm talking to you guys that I'm writing it, but I want to like talk, like kind of transition into the publishing talk rather than just um, editing and writing talk, you know? Uh, click, please. There we go. <laughs> Started a little of my clack class. Interesting. V that's awesome you started it. Yay. And Eva, you are so sweet. Give me one second. I want to go see this sticker. It doesn't show up on stream yet. Thank you so much. I'm I'm giving you virtual hugs. You are the sweetest. Yeah, let me, I want to see this. I got to go to the chat on my phone. That's awkward. There's an ad for me. Oh, it's so cute. Oh my God. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. Well, thank you so much, Eva. Finished a chapter. Very, very nice. I got an email. It doesn't matter. <laughs> um, I made a TikTok by paying for the second sprint. Y'all, I got on a TikTok binge the other day. I started making TikToks like crazy. There is one TikTok that I'm, or like TikToks are surreal, that I made that I'm so excited for. It's kind of dumb that I'm saying that about my own stuff, but it was me dressing up like my characters. And I'm so excited to share it. Um, but Drea, yay. I feel like make, I used to be like, I'm not on that TikTok trend, but guys, I'm on it now. I'm not so much swept up in watching TikToks. I do love making them. <laughs> Wrote exactly 99. Love that. Just trying to finish YouTube video while I started the Buffy the Empire Slayer. <laughs> nice. Using these to my first ever freelance co-training project. Oh my gosh, yay, Catherine. Awesome. That's exciting. <gasps> oh. Dialogue is always easiest for me. Yes, it comes easier. I am the same. I swear. It's just, it, it's easy to like picture what people would say, you know? But when you kind of have to go into the nitty gritty of like, what is she doing while she's saying this? You know, like that's where I kind of struggle because that's where I start to repeat my action tags. You know, like, is she running her hands through her hair? Is she playing with her fingers? You know, I don't know. I, I, I reuse things a lot and that's the majority of what my editing is having to go back and making sure not everybody is smiling so stinking much. <laughs> yes, it's it's amazing. It is so fun. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, okay, it is, it is like this. You know what I should do? I should change my, uh, like, color scheme here to match it. But it's like this kind of brightish magenta shade. It's very pretty. It's very. We had it kind of a darker magenta, and it was pretty too. But it kind of matched a little too close. So we can't catch our breath. I'll show you. I'll I'll change like this this for the next sprint to match the same color. Yeah, thank you. I love getting colors for my next book. My designer, she's so incredibly talented. Yes, it's so crazy because I am not artistic in the very least. So it's crazy to see people like come up with something so awesome. You know. I I think that's crazy, and I, I think it's awesome. I, I hired um, Keelan uh, for my What Are Friends For cover rebrand. because Well, I did the front cover myself uh, for What Are Friends For, and then I didn't have a paperback cover wrap, and so I hired Keelan, and oh my gosh, I kind of like lost my mind at how amazing it was. <laughs> it, I, I can't wait to show you guys. I ordered copies. It looks amazing. I wish I was artistic, but I'm really not. What's that now? I started publishing like every three months. I, I I mean, it's not intentional, but I am writing really fast. Well, I mean, it's kind of intentional. It's not like I'm I'm not gunning for like a three month. Man, my hair looks really bad when I did that. I'm not gunning for three months. I'm just kind of writing at a pace that I enjoy writing at, you know? I don't know. I just, I love it. Um, and But I've, I've always been kind of a quick writer too. Wish you could publish quicker, but for the series, it's not happening. Each book is like 500 pages long. Oh my gosh, yeah. I think one every year or so for these is pretty good. Yes, that's fantastic. Oh my gosh, yes. And it's 500 pages plus. I totally, yes. And plus, we all, everybody writes like a different pace, you know? And I think that's great to see all the differences. I think it's fun too to follow people, like when, like seeing those differences. I really enjoyed that. 
Um, oh, calculus. Yes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> calculus. Hearing that word makes me like, <laughs> for some reason, to have actual physical school, like my other teacher, my math teacher sent us a recording of class in high school. So not sure what happened there. Weird. That's really strange. Hmm. My computer is not. <gasps> Give me one second. Ah! Hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Oh my gosh. So my, <laughs> hang on. I got to plug this back in. My, uh, uh, oh, let me turn back on. Ooh. My, my, one of my ports, ports to the P on my, um, computer doesn't work if I want to charge it. So I had my, I forgot, I had my charger in that port. So my, my computer was about to die. Whew. It, it got, it started to lag. I'm like, what's going on? It's because it's at 5%. <laughs> Only 114 words. I had to take some time to help mom around the house. So not as many as I wanted. If I'm happy, I'm breaking out of the writer's block I've been in. Yes, I'm so happy breaking out of it too. Writer's block is so hard. Uh, uh, so I'm happy that you are getting out of it. The same with having you know, one, yeah, mm, young adult fantasy recommendations or young adult books recommendations with lots of drama. Mm, fantasy. I don't know. Uh, oh, I would have to agree. Anything by Cassandra Clare. Oh my gosh, Cassandra Clare's newest book is coming out soon. Oh my gosh. Let me see. Okay, I think I'm going to start. Oh, wait here. There's a hat. Oh my gosh, that was so close. <laughs> uh, and it's. It's the top left one, actually. Yes, top left. I don't know. I I cannot wait to get the new MacBook because this one's having it giving me so many problems. I hate the keyboard. I hate the butterfly keyboard, y'all. It sucks. <laughs> uh, Stephanie, well, I'm so happy you're here. We have another. We have three more sprints to do, actually. So you haven't missed anything, my friend. Um, all right, let's do a 20 minute one this time, shall we? No, 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 friend. No, no, hang on. Crap. Oh, there you go. <laughs> okay, let's do, let's do 21. 21. How about that? Uh, okay, full screen. I'm ready to get back into some sprints. So let's do that and we will chat again once this one is over. So I will see you guys in 21 minutes, 21 seconds, and get all those words in in three, two, one. Let's go. <laughs>
Yay. Second sprint of the night is done. We got two more. We're honestly making great time. It's eight o'clock right now. And I swear, like, I usually, I guess I just usually talk more. I don't know. I've just been, I'm, I'm like coming down the home stretch. So I think that has something to say. Like, that's why I'm just like, oh, yes. <laughs> I, <laughs> I just finished the chapter. It's very angsty. Um, I don't know. I mean, I, I like angst, you know, but I'm just second guessing myself at this point. Um, I'm on page 289 of 316. Um, there might be one more scene I want to add. Like I, there's at least one thing that I want to edit. Like I want to insert, but not completely add a new scene. It's an old scene. Just fix it. That's what editing is, Sarah. But there's one scene that I think I really just want to add. And um, I don't know. Anyway, uh, really quick, um, I want to show you guys. Uh, hello, hello. But this color, this way, there, that color, is the color that's going to be on Stella's book. So that's what Stella's book's color is going to be, you guys. Also, hello. Um, and that is actually what I'm working on. I am working on editing Destelle's book and getting it sent off to beta readers tonight. So, yeah. Hey, Hannah. So glad you can make it. Uh, fish and wine YouTube and started some journaling for the evening. Very nice. Also, I forgot. I wanted to go up here and talk about this. What does everyone think of the chosen one trope these days? Honestly, Gio, if you love it, I think you should write it, you know? I think sometimes, like... I I think you should write it if you want to write it, you know? Like, I, I mean, I, 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 I just say do it if you want to do it, you know? I, that's, that's my take on it. And it's okay. We still have two more sprints to write, to write, to do. So, lots of time. Lots of time. It's time for me, so go on as long as you wish. <laughs> We're going to go until nine my time. So, eight your time. So, one more hour. Finished a chapter I was not enjoying revising, and now it's draft three. Nikki's problem. Yes! Yes! I feel that so much. That's how, I, how it was with um, actually the entire ending for this book. I completely skipped it. I'm like, eh, it's editing Sarah's issue. <laughs> 279 words and style just turned into angst and dread. Ooh, some very good emotions. But I don't know. I love that. I love that. I love angst. Angst is fun. Angst has a very fine line between being acceptable and like overly dramatic <laughs> for me. Like, I feel like I just cannot tell if this is good angst or ye angst, you know? <laughs> it's fine. I can always dial it back and like develop the emotions a bit more. I just don't know where I, I just, you know, I just need a second pair of eyes to look over it. Or, you know, I have, I have more than one beta reader, but. Ooh, manage edit four and a half pages of my manuscript. That's awesome. Yay. Finished up that two more chapters. Very nice. Oh, sorry. Uh, Nice, nice. I think that was the same thing. Oh, and you outlined. Oh, you outlined and it, but a wider way. Awesome job. Awesome productivity. And yes, I love it. It looks so gorgeous on the cover. I cannot wait for you guys to see it. I'm trying to push this chapter. I'm trying to edit a reader reaction vlog. Ooh, I love that. I've been wanting to do, um, when, when Cassandra Clare's next book comes out, I really want to do like a read with me vlog i've never done that before so i don't know how it's gonna go i'm a binge reader so it, it would probably only take a day to be honest so maybe it wouldn't even be that interesting it probably just be time lapses and me reading <laughs> but i feel like it's fun to like talk about a book and i have no one else to talk about it with so i feel like vlogging it and talking to the camera could be really fun <laughs> i've never done that before new stream pop -up. I like the um little bubbles over here is that what you mean? I, I think they're kind of fun. At first I wasn't sure because it took a minute to load. But now I kind of do. I don't know if I'll be able to do any writing tonight. Wait, I have a two-hour delay tomorrow. So maybe I'm going to do fun. Ooh, two-hour delay. That's nice. Be safe. 
I've got three chapters or scenes to get through and I'll be finished with act one of my first draft. Oh my gosh, it's so exciting. Yay, you guys, that's awesome. Logging camera shift should be around and I start filming author two videos. Ah! Oh my gosh. I feel like it's so exciting. Like like new equipment is always so cool. I I got my camera right off the bat, which is super epic too. But I almost kind of wish I had started off with my phone at first because that way I could like, I don't know, like have those milestones of getting new equipment. When I unboxed my ring light, I was so tickled to death, even though I still cannot figure out how to angle it so my, I look normal. <laughs> like right now it's fine because my computer does an okay job at, um, like it, it's not as great quality as my camera. So my camera is trying to pick up all of the, I don't know what I'm trying to say. It's just more, it's nicer. So it picks up like all the shadows and stuff. <laughs> so I gotta figure out how to, to work by reading line. But very exciting about your vlogging camera. Let's see if I can. You definitely have got this. Yes. 217, very nice. How do you feel about the Narnia movies? I honestly, I only remember watching the first one. And I remember liking the first one. I don't remember watching the other ones. I don't know why. I was really little when I watched the first one. So maybe I wasn't the, I wasn't um as, like, I, 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 don't, I don't know if I was old enough to become obsessed with something. Do you know what I mean? When did they come out? When did the first one come out? When did the first Narnia movie come out? Which one? The first one, idiot. Oh, 2005. So, <laughs> the Chronicles of Narnia. December 9th. So I would have been six. So I don't, I don't know if I would have, you know I, mean? I don't know. I need to watch the other ones because I remember I enjoyed the first one, but my voice is getting, my throat's getting scratchy, but I don't know if I want to open my wine. I'm, I don't know. I wanted to, but now that I'm thinking about it, I don't know if that's a good idea for right now. Maybe when I'm finished with the draft. Five handwritten pages. Nice, Drea. Yay. I always go super over the top to my it as I want. And then I draw it back. That way I have the expression for myself in the mirror. Yeah. That's actually a really good idea because it's, I feel like it's easier to draw back than kind of like invent more. I I just don't know. I don't know. Hang on. Ah. 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 Ooh, okay. Well, honest, honestly, I don't think I've picked any colors for my books except for If the Room Fits. Um, I will show you. I don't think I think I I think this is the only one I picked the colors for. Only because I wanted orange because it's Halloween-y, and then the orange kind of matched up here. It's fine. But this was the only one I think I picked. And then of course Distel not yeah, Distel's book. I wanted pink because pink would look really pretty next to this purple and so like so sometimes like for the ones in the future i'm going to have a say over the colors because i can just like picture the color like like the colors that fit the person so like edith's book i want it to be um green i'm not sure what shade of green yet i'm thinking more like a darkish green maybe i don't know i'm not really sure i'm not sure about the green yet but then molly's book Molly is going to, I want Molly to have a yellow um, cover because also I think it'd be really fun because yellow, I don't have Water Friends 4 near me, but yellow would offset fun with Water Friends 4 and that was my other winter novel. So I just think it'd be kind of fun, but out of my league and Can't Catch a Breath and Water Friends 4, I did not pick actually. I don't know. I don't know why I didn't. The, um, my designer did Water Friends 4 and I just went along with it. Actually, to be honest, tangent, I was not sold on the Water Friends 4 color scheme. To be honest, I think I hated it at first. Only because, like, it's not me. Blue and yellow are not my colors. I love blue and yellow. But, you guys, I mean, like, look, I'm a pink gal. <laughs> so, when she gave me the color scheme of blue and yellow in that cover, I was like, do I like this? I don't know if I do, you know? And and then the more I watched, like, looked at it and I talked to people about it, 
um, they enjoyed it. And I'm like, okay, yeah, you're right. These are kind of like wintry colors. Pink isn't always really a wintry color, um, but blue definitely can be. And uh, so, yeah, we, that's why we went with blue and yellow because she picked it. And I'm like, Ooh, okay, I think I like it. And now I can't even imagine anything different for what her friends for. It's kind of crazy. Uh, I binge read until the book is finished. So, however long that takes. Sometimes it takes all day. Sometimes it doesn't take that long. I feel like if I had to binge read my books, it would take two, three hours, maybe. Probably. Let me see. I don't have a channel, but sometimes if I'm doing something, I would just start talking to myself and other people that don't exist about what I'm doing to make things make sense. Oh my gosh, I do that too! That's why I kind of thought I'd be really good at vlogging, <laughs> because I just talk to myself. I've always done it, actually. So that's funny. That's awesome that you do it too. Uh, hello, hello! So glad you can make it. We're going to start our third sprint very soon. Um, mid two thousand. Yeah, it, 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 the, it's kind of crazy because it doesn't feel like it was that long ago, but it was. That was a lifetime ago. Uh, hello, hello! Thank you for popping in. And yes, everyone, drink some water, stretch, posture check, etc. I have the worst posture. The thing is, though, if I like look at you, like, my double chin comes into play. So we're just gonna we're just gonna keep the chin up. I'm just kidding. I don't really care, but. I am, I'm a sloucher. Is anybody else a sloucher? I'm like a natural sloucher, and it's not good. I need to fix it, but it's okay. It's fine. You know, oh, here we go. And if you're in Texas, please stay safe. Yes, everyone who is in Texas, stay safe. Oh, my gosh. I've been seeing pictures on social media. The pictures are insane. I'm, see, Emerald Green is really pretty. Ooh, ooh, okay. Hang on. I like that. If it if it ends up being emerald green, you have the entire you can brag. You have bragging rights. And as soon as I'm on the phone with my boyfriend, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I'm always embarrassed. My people, my my friend, my friends, my family catches me um, talking to myself. I'm so embarrassed. So I mean, having like a pretending it's your boyfriend that's great. <laughs> uh, let's get into our third sprint since it's. Uh, where did I put my phone? Uh, I, I literally just had it. I was just talking to Siri. I don't know. Okay. okay. I have no idea where it went. It's fine. Let's do a 20. Oops. Let's do a 25 minute sprint. 25. 25, 59. How about that? It's technically like six minutes, but you know, it's fine. Um, let's. Let us start our spoil. Oh, there's commenting on hand, hand, hand. Uh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> I have tipped in, into an organization to help me out. Most vulnerable. Texas. That's awesome. Alexis, that's amazing. Hello, I almost missed the location. I'm glad you're not finished sprinting yet. No, we still have two more. Yes, yes, yes. Um, so I had to hop off now. I have to bring in fire red for my mom and then me and my partner have to drive home. It's so random. Well, be safe driving home. Drive safe. And yes, make, just drive safe. Oh my gosh. We, I had to go into work on Tuesday and that was right after the big snowstorm and it was crazy. Oh my gosh. We're getting snow here as well. But so drive safe, Amanda. Have a good rest of your night as well. Definitely have to buy that book. If so, I will tell you a lot of moments to certain content. Oh, I totally understand. Totally understand. Um, I'm going to grab some water. You guys should get some hydration too before we get started. Yes, good idea. If anybody wants to go grab some water, definitely do. Who's Rosh's? I'm gonna shout out to. Uh, sure, Alexis, that'd be great. Thank you. And we just got a ton of snow here. Yeah, that snowstorm was no joke. I was just talking to somebody about how this the weather where we are in Michigan has been kind of um mild this year. The winter has been mild. And then there comes that snowstorm. So I totally jinxed it. I'm so sorry. Uh, 25 minutes, 59 seconds on the clock. Uh, I might go get me a Coke. I don't know. Do I want to take a... Do I want to... Uh, no, I'll wait until I'm done. Maybe I should go make me a coffee. I'll figure something out. <laughs> Three, two, one. Let's start our sprint.
Giselle did not like that noise. Third sprint. Oh, I did I forget to do the banner? Of course I did. <laughs> Third sprint of the night is done. How do we do? Let me see. I'm on page 290 of 319. I added a page. Crap. Uh, <laughs> but right now, I, I realized as I was like going through it, I'm like, did I cut a scene with the main character and her little brother? And I did. <laughs> so, don't know how that happened because it was a good scene. I had to go back and add it in. And I still have to figure out like how they're like what they're gonna say to each other because her relationship with her little brother she feels more she feels closer to him than she does with her little sister they are twins um not her and her brother the sister and her brother they're twins uh so she kind of feels closer to her brother even though he's kind of like a little booger um but i don't know why i would have cut this scene like it was a good scene i mean it's got to change because what they talk about before doesn't really fit with the story this time but, uh, yeah, that's where I'm at now. And then after that, she's got a conversation with somebody else. One more conversation. And then we have the beginning of the end. We're very close. We have 20 pages. <sighs> 20 pages. Wait, no. Yes. No. 30? 30. 10? <laughs> I can't do math. 30. <laughs> well, technically 21. 29? 20. Forget it. We're just going to stop there. <laughs> uh, I almost got to lay down this print because I couldn't think of what to write. I, in the beginning, I left. I had, so I, when I sat back down, I'm like, oh man, I just wasted like five minutes. <laughs> but that's okay. Sometimes you got to brainstorm what you want to write, you know? And sometimes, like, you just need time to, um, just, you know, chill out. Like in this sprint, I was, I was jamming to my music more often than reading. And you know what? That's okay. It's called inspiration, Sarah. It's fine. <laughs> I'm trying to reassure myself, even though I know it was procrastination. <laughs> but not not you, me. Sorry, Tabitha. Th not you. Um, but I hope you figure out what you're going to write for the next sprint. <gasps> Tabitha, you're bringing back the... Uh, I forgot we did this. I super forgot we did this. Your last word is pickles. My last word was him. So pickles him. <laughs> Basically, draft two of book two is just a bunch of reorganizing and rewriting because book one changed so much. I wrote all the first tracks in series in a row. So I'm putting a puzzle together. I think that sounds awesome, though. Kind of sounds fun. Kind of sounds like it needs a lot of brain power. <laughs> but that's awesome, though, Vicky. Um. Only got one chapter outline, but I got the banana bread in the oven. Oh my goodness, you're gonna have to tell us how it goes, how it tastes too. I'll live vicariously through you. <laughs> 582, very nice. Very, that's actually really nice. Whew. 83 words in, I'm liking this poem so far. Well, that's amazing, Alexandria. I love that name so much. Uh, <laughs> that's awesome. Lizzie set up writer's journal planning backstory of love interest number three and who she ends up with in Protective Dispute. Very fun, Lizzie. Very fun. Oh, my comments jumped. Hang on. Read another chapter. Yay. Cooked a hot dog and ate with a sandwich. It's morning here. Well, good morning. Uh, very nice. Sounds like a great little meal. Trying to decide if I want to end the scene. Oh, Hang on. I gotta show my door. <laughs> She started to talk to my dad, and she was very loud. <laughs> my my dog pushed my door open, so it's okay. <laughs> I'm trying to decide if I want to end this scene or continue it. I want to end it because I want to be done with it, but it feels like it needs to go on a bit. You know what you could do? You could, I mean, I'm not, I don't know if you're this kind of person. I know it kind of varies for people, but what I do if a scene like feels like it's not driving, I just use like those bracket things, and I write out what I want, what I think could happen. Um, in the scene, and then when I come back to it, it's kind of easy, easier to have an idea of where I want to go with it. But I know a lot of people don't like to skip ahead like that. I don't do it often. It's kind of like a rare thing for me. Like, I because if I if I did it often, then I would be doing the entire book that way. <laughs> but when you're really stuck, when I'm really stuck, sometimes it helps. 
601 words. Wow! I'm working on a scene where my character is trying to get out of grief for BFFs. Ooh, if she doesn't fix herself. Grief can be really tricky. So I love that. I love how that sounds, Hannah. That sounds cool. I'm reading when I'm writing during the stream. That's awesome. I can't wait till my books come. The problem is, I, so I ordered Chain of Chain of Iron and Covet. They're both coming on the same day because they both got released on the same day. And they're both 600 pages long. Because usually when I buy a book, I binge read it, like I mentioned before. I cannot binge read both those books in one day. <laughs> I cannot do it. <laughs> There's no way. Um, so I'm going to have to figure out which one I want to do first. That kind of hurts my soul. Finish my calculus class. Yay! And uh, Drea, I started at the beginning of this print. I got good flow, so going. So I'm going to continue. Yes, definitely continue. If you got a good flow, do it. Do it, do it, do it. Continue. You got this. <sighs> what time is it? Oh. In the beginning of this sprint, I said we were making great time. We're, we're kind of behind. Although I did talk a lot last time. Finished ending chapter 10 in a dream sequence. These sprints are honestly so help helping so much. That's what I love about sprints. I haven't done one in forever, but they do help so stinking much. For me, anyway. Like, you know what I mean? Like, oh, I mean, I, like I just said, I do talk a lot. But when I do write, I find that they help more so when I'm editing rather than drafting for me. Um, or, well, uh, depends. Depends. Okay, I guess uh, I'm contradicting myself because I just remember that I once had a problem with sprints. I guess maybe for me it goes in waves. Sometimes it's really helpful, sometimes it's not helpful. This time it's really helpful because the end is in sight and I'm so excited. <laughs> I don't know why I got so animated about that. <laughs> Love interest number three is dad died. His mom married protagonist's best friend. And his mom came, became abusive. Oh, no. Well, it sounds like an interesting dynamic, Lizzie. Interesting to write for sure. The comments jumped again. Give me one second, please. There we go. I think I'm going to take this last one to finish soon. I'm going to take a longer break before working on, on the last two chapters. Ooh. Oh my gosh, you're getting so close. Definitely take a break if you feel that you need one, for sure. Um, but oh, I suck at math. Whenever I think about how bad I am at math, I remember that last, this past June, I said, guys, what are friends for is six months old. And I promoted the post on Instagram. And like 2,000 people saw it before I realized it's not six months old. It's five months old. I'm like, it's just I I I just mm, <laughs> that's what I always might think of. I'm just that bad at math. I cannot do numbers at all. Ooh, sir, tell I love sir, charm, cute. See, like coming out coming at it with the last words makes it sound so magical and fun. You know, like ooh, what could it, what could the sentence be? Uh, Red King Kitchen on Valentine's Day and the day after and loved it. Still that it. <laughs> well, I'm glad you liked it. <laughs> Thank you for reading it. Last word was it in my journal. Very nice. Geo got about 600 words. And oh my goodness, 1,293 words. <gasps> That's amazing. Oh my gosh. Tickle him. <laughs> oh, I love that. <laughs> uh, I have four love interests. It's Mr. Who's writing the poems and put that's in the backseat in the same map. Well, that's fun. Uh, how do you feel about good about books that have a lot of gossip and drama in them and have you read American Royals? See, I haven't I actually have not read that one. And honestly, I as of late I've not been reading too many contemporary books. Like the books I'm reading are like dystopian or fantasy or paranormal. Well, I guess, yeah, the Crave Crush books are, are paranormal. Um, but, or this, I, feel, I always get them mixed up. Uh, but uh, I haven't been really reading much contemporary, and I don't really find a lot of gossip and drama um, in those kinds of books, because they're more really plot, you know what I mean? Like, it's not 
not that I've noticed. However, I don't think it'd be a bad thing. I think it can add some tension. If you, if, you know what I mean? I think it definitely could add some tension. Which is great. We love tension here. I haven't tried to refrain from using too many brackets and such because it adds more to me in the next draft. I may be able to go for those scenes. It's just doing it. I get you. I get you. I get you. I'm making this a big family, so it'll be fun to write. I haven't written a big family yet. This is my first time writing siblings. Y'all, I've been struggling. <laughs> I don't know why. I have siblings. Like, why is it so hard? I mean, they're older siblings, so that could be hard. That, that's probably why. But they are. They can be so helpful for me, too. And I totally agree. Um, sometimes I go back and watch sprints after the fact. Just because then I can, like, skip like the talking bits and go straight to the sprint but it is kind of sad because you're not you won't have anyone to talk with i mean i just said i would skip the talking bits i just meant like it's fun to do it live because you can talk but if i miss them live then i go back and i watch the replay there we go imagine people binge read the way they binge drink oh my god <laughs> I got an idea for country romance series and motivation to plan it. I don't ever really plan out things very well. I need to. I need to get better. <laughs> I have to finish a scene about getting over grief pretty quickly and I can't lose the pain she feels all at once. It isn't something I'm struggling with. I'll figure it out. Have you used um, the emotion thesaurus, Hannah? Because grief is in here and actually this one's really good. And... And so is this one. It's the emotional wound thesaurus. Um, so it has grief in here as well. It's, so it's like a list of um, like emotional wounds that a character can have. I, I found it really helpful for planning. I found these both really helpful for planning out um, Adeline, who actually just lost her dad um, in a car accident. So these two books really helpful, were really helpful for me. I don't know if you have used them or not. If, I mean, they're on Amazon. So, if you haven't, I would check them out. Okay. I will be so happy if I finish Act 1. That's awesome. Yes, you're going to get this. You're going to get this. I'm so excited for you. I can't wait till I finish this draft. I'm so excited. <laughs> the language, yes, for sure. Ugh, ugh. I didn't realize it because I was I write in Word doc. I write in Word too. Last word is in veins. Ooh, ooh. The more exciting incident plot point is coming soon. I feel like the longer I keep up with grief, however interesting, maybe people get bored quickly. I think. Um. Hmm. I get that. And I feel like too, it's hard to know. You know, I I don't know. I I understand where you're coming from. I totally do. Because I feel like I had the same issue with... Because it's hard because when you're carrying on the same emotion, it kind of can feel repetitive. But I wonder if it just feels repetitive because we're the authors. I wonder how how it will sound reading it. I don't know. Hmm. But I think you've got this, Hannah. Last word, enough. Love it. Last word is movies. Last word is will. <laughs> the word, not the name. <laughs> I love that. Uh, I'm gonna get one words in thirty minutes. Now. That's okay. There's no. I mean, that's totally okay. I think that's great. It's so progress. Um, <laughs> Miss Lizzie, I'm really enjoying this one point of view chapter, and honestly, I'm gonna love as much just because the words around and it's really endearing. Ooh, I love endearing stuff. Oh my gosh. Um, I'm going to uh get to the bottom because we don't have that many comments left, and then we're gonna start our last sprint of the night. <laughs> Um, because I wish I had one on that's Catherine. <laughs> I really outline it. it's really good to the greatest flaw. Feel that. I feel that. I feel that. It's so good. It's so good. Make sure you have the second edition if you can afford it. I mean, it, it can be, a little, I think this one's like $17. The other one was, actually, was this one 17 I don't know. This one was more expensive than the base one, but this one, the second edition, has so many more entries and i would definitely suggest going that route because the other one's good this one's fantastic um i have not i definitely recommend them 
I have the ebook versions. It definitely help me want to write something like anger. You'll have to, you'll have the options to show it. Yeah, yeah. Um, like for example, so this one, this one is connectedness. It gives you a definition, physical signals and behaviors, internal sensations, mental responses, acute or long-term responses to the emotion, signs that the emotion is being suppressed. The emotion may escalate to, and then it gives you a list of different emotions. The motion may de-escalate to, and then associated power verbs, like accept, affect, appreciate, words like that. It's really helpful. I think I have a video on it in my channel. It's so like back towards the beginning of my channel, I think. So good. So good. I can leave a link once we start the sprint. I can leave a link in the um, chat. Have you used the emotion source before? I used to, but I found that they didn't really help me too much because it's a lot of information and I don't remember stuff like that. I more so build characters when it comes to editing. In drafting, I don't really build the characters too much. Um, like, I don't make them unique in the first draft too much. I do that in the second draft. And then by then, taking a test is just I, I don't know I feel like for me it doesn't work as well because I've got a terrible memory but I think like I wish I could I wish they were good for me to utilize because they sound cool that's probably one of the I know it looks like that there, there's a few of them actually there's quite a few of them they're really good and yes definitely agree um, I will start the next sprint, the last sprint of the night, and then I'll go ahead and I'll hop over to Amazon and pop the links in the chat for you guys to those books. Um, 857. Uh, let's do, let's do like a 17 minute sprint. Let's do 17, 17. Gio, isn't that your number? I think it's your number. Uh, yes, Tabitha, this is the last sprint. We're going a little bit over nine o'clock, but honestly, it's okay. Oh my gosh, Hannah, I use smile like way too often. It's insane. <laughs> I know I'm going to have to cut that down in the next draft, but you know, it's fine. <laughs> All right, I will start our final sprint of the night right now in three, two, one. Happy writing, my friends.
that is it for the sprints, my friends. Whew. How did we do? I didn't do much that final one. I, what did I do? Ah, no, I'm still, still on the same page. Well, I, 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 mm, no, I'm not, no, no. Um, I just didn't do much. Do you want to go back out into the hallway? Hang on. Puppy wants out of my room. Hang on. Be free. Oh, there's a second dog at the door. Hello. Are you coming in? Yes, I'll just leave it cracked. All right. <clears throat> All right. Come on. I'm feeling kind of like I need, I need like a, hmm, I don't know. Nothing. It's fine. I'm fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> uh just gonna wait my blank challenge for the damn flame we're good well that's great let me alter the banner hang on let me say thanks for joining us that way if anybody comes in they know that we are not sprinting anymore um and zara popped in hello yay uh, i'm glad i got a chance to like this way well i'm glad you could pop in and say hello too the homework fast sprint. I have to reread what I have so far on book two, so I figure out where to go next. Ooh, very nice. Rereading is good. <sighs> Finished your backstory right now, thinking about what to do with the new page. Ooh, very exciting. Uh, 175, last word if, last word suspected, misunderstanding. If suspected, misunderstanding, yeah, that kind of works. <laughs> Got some good editing done. Thanks so much for the sprints. Well, Diana, thank you so much for coming. I had a lot of fun. I got a lot done, except for the final sprint. I did not do anything that final sprint. Yikes. Oh, let me turn that into a ticker. Um, our next sprint is going to be Sunday. Let me check. I think it's Sunday. Um, I can't believe I can't remember. Uh, okay, wait. Here. It is going to be Sunday. The 20th. No. That's not Sunday. Ten days from now, the twenty eighth. Um, yeah. Last word was similar. Love that. Three forty nine words, and then she's finding herself in her dragon again. It's a dragon story, by the way. Last word, writing. Love that. Hmm. Outline chapter to love five outlined. Alexis, that's amazing. Productive night. Holy cow. Uh, random question. How do you save pages in your journal? Make last longer with my writing. Would, uh, save page. I, I have the kind of journal that you can't tear out pages. So I just, I'm, I, I think that's what you mean. I'm not sure. Can't for the 28th. Yay! I'm so, I'm really excited. I, I need to get back into streaming because I love this so much. Um, I just love chatting. You know, it's really nice to chat. I love this little community that we have built on this channel. Um, it, it for the most part, it's very, it's very awesome. <laughs> so, I think I've only got, I only, I get spam comments once in a while that are like weird that I have to block. But otherwise, uh, man, was quite productive. Oh yay! I'm glad it was productive for you. Uh, thank you so much for coming, Hannah. Have a great rest of your night and enjoy your reading. Um, yes, yes, yes. I think I'm going to start with whiskey, band of red, and you're watching Kim Possible on Disney. <gasps> Kim Possible is on Disney Plus. How did I not realize this? <gasps> oh my gosh. I'm going to have to. Uh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Thank you for mentioning that because I, I don't know why I did not realize it. Oh, I love it. <laughs> um, they are not. I don't think I have seen them. No, this is the first comment that I have seen, Drea. Uh, oh, I don't write in it that often. <laughs> I actually started this one in 2019, I think. I can look. I made I made a date. That's my t page of index. Yeah, June 9th, 2019. I don't write in it a lot. Um, and I don't write a lot in it when I do write. So that's probably why. Uh, just have just have a roommate about the randomest topics. I love that. Oh, Hannah sees them. That's so weird. 
that's weird. Drea, I don't think, just give me a second, okay? <laughs> She's crying because she wants a cuddle buddy. Have a great rest of your day as well. Um, last word, puppy. <gasps> oh, puppies. <laughs> this fantasy poem is massive. I love it. I love it. Uh, thank you. Thank you so much for doing this. Wow, that's awesome! Um, writing a vampire romance. That's amazing. Well, I'm so happy you um got so much done. Thank you so much for spending. Have, have a great night. Have a great night as well, Charlie. Okay, so that is so weird. Why is Streamyard being weird? Oh, I see this one. So my last word is hot. Make of that what you will. <laughs> oh, I love it. It's my dog. She wants cuddles. Oh, I should probably go give her cuddles. Uh, thank you all to for coming and well, come here. Do you want to say goodbye to the camera? She says no. Thank you for coming and writing with me and spending this these past two hours with me. I had a lot of fun. So remember the twenty eighth. Oh, today was gonna be a ten k day. Crap. Nope. Okay, that's not gonna happen. What's the what day is the twenty eighth? It is a Sunday. Let Oh no, the 21st was going to be a 10K day. But I don't have a stream on the 21st. Let's do a 10K day on the 28th. Because that way we're streaming that day. And I'll be drafting. I should be drafting then. So, yeah. All right, friends. Uh, thanks for streaming. Oh, I think that would be awesome. And yes, of course, thank you so much for coming. Have a great night, everyone. Or great morning, afternoon, or night. I will see you guys on the 28th. And don't forget, I have a vlog coming out tomorrow. So if you want to go show that some love, it's coming out tomorrow. <laughs> see you guys next.